and welcome back to the Graceful Tangle YouTube channel. I'm Amy Kate, a young but passionate knitto and crocheter. Thank you so much for joining me today. If you're looking for me on social media, you can find me on Instagram, Etsy, Ravelry, and Pinterest as the Graceful Tangle. On Ravelry and Etsy, you can find and purchase my knit and crochet patterns. And also on Ravelry, you can find the Graceful Tangle podcast group and join in on all of the fun chatter we have going on over there. So again, thank you so much for joining me today. I am so excited to be back with you guys for another super exciting video. But first, if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to my channel and then click the notification bell so you can know each and every time I upload a video. So today I am back with you guys talking about another Knit Picks haul. Um, I am so excited to be sharing all of these things with you. But first, let me give you a little bit of a backstory. So I have recently gotten the amazing opportunity to become a Knit Picks brand ambassador. So what that means um, is just I will be showing you a little bit more Knit Picks content and you'll see that on my Instagram feed as well. So if you go follow me over on there, you'll be able to see all of the exciting events that are going to start happening. Um, but some of this yarn will be for or almost all of this yarn will be specifically for designs for um, knit picks and for my little business as well. So I hope that you enjoy this video and enjoy following along with me on this journey of being a brand ambassador. So let's jump right into the goodies. And so I'm going to apologize ahead of time for any crinkling or noises that you um, might hear. I'm going to try my best to be quiet but I haven't gone through this box yet so if I put something quickly that would be why. So first we have quite a bit of Knit Picks Dishy. This will be for a super exciting design that I cannot wait to get started on um, but let's talk a little bit about it. So we have two skeins of Dishy in the color, I think this is the color Mint but I'm trying to find, yes, Mint. So two skeins of the color mint. We have two skeins of dishy in the color. Let's see, I think this is honeydew. Yes, honeydew. So if you aren't familiar with Knit Picks Dishy, it is a 100% cotton yarn. It comes in 100 gram skeins, and the price point is just incredible for how much yarn you get. This is my favorite 100% um, cotton yarn. I just love it. It is perfect for dishcloths, washcloths, um, placemats, things like that that get a lot of use. It's not the softest. Like They have other cotton options that are great for garments or something that's going to require wear or um, wear against skin. But for like kitchen and bathroom items, this yarn is just perfect. So Two skeins of honeydew, one skein of silver, let's see if there's any, yeah. We have a dishy cone, so this is just a very large version of the individual balls. Um, and this is the color creme brulee, so it's this gorgeous mustardy yellow. It's just so pretty, and it does have a plastic, um, and a wrapper on it so that's the shininess that you see but I love this color it's very color accurate as well it matches the <laughs> matches my shirt too okay and then we have another cone of dishy in the color silver so this is the same as this color of course and it's just a really beautiful silvery gray Let's see if there's any more dishy that I can dig out. Doo -doo. Yes. Oh, no. That's not dishy. Okay, I think that's all of dishy. Okay, now we have a few skeins. Let's see. Four skeins of Simply Wool Twist. This is a worsted weight yarn. It is... 100% Eco Wool, which is super exciting. This is the color Wordsworth and Wanda, 218 yards per 100 grams. And again, this is a worsted weight wool. So this is actually not quite available on their website yet, but it will be very, very soon. 
Um, and I'm so excited to be able to have the opportunity to work with it. So let's see, I think this is a different color. Yes, so this is called Winnie and Wallace. So this um, has more brown in it and a little bit of gray so you can see the different strands. And then this color, Wordsworth and Wanda, is just ever so slightly different. So this has more brown, this has more gray. So beautiful. And it smells like wool. Oh my goodness, I love that smell. Mm. So yes, there's that. Okay, and then we have some stroll fingering. This is the color Orbit Tonal. Look at how beautiful that is. It reminds me of um, like space and colors that you would see if you were to see a picture of space. So gorgeous. Midnight Blue. So again, this is the color Orbit Tonal. This is a fingering weight. It is so soft. This will be my first time using their Stroll line. Um, and it is 75% Superwash Merino Wool, 25% Nylon. And I have two skeins of that. And then we have some Stroll Glimmer. This is their um, Bayo. So this is undyed and I wanted like a um, a natural white color, and this is um, their Glimmer, so it has some Selena in it. It is 75%, 70, excuse me, 70% fine superwash merino wool, 25% nylon, 5% Selena. Um, I don't know if you can be able to see, I think you can see it a little, a little bit. Yeah. Look at that glitter. Look at how beautiful that is. And this is... Let me see if I can find the yardage. Yeah, 462 yards per 100 grams. So yeah, super excited to use that. Okay, and then we have Stroll Tweed. This is the color Lapis, I believe is how you say it. Um, this is so tweedy. I love how this looks. Look how fun that is. So this is 65% fine superwash merino wool, 25% nylon, 10% dongle tweed. Again, so soft. All of their shoulder yarns are incredibly soft. They feel so nice. And then we have some more stroll fingering. This is the color Sprinkle Heather, 231 yards per 50 grams. And that's the same for the tweed as well. I don't think I said that. Um, again, this is the color Sprinkle Heather. Yeah, you can see the heather there. So it has some purples, teals, brighter blues, a little bit of pink it looks like in there too. Um, I have two skeins of that. And then we have two skeins of Knit Picks Felinci. This is the color Cupcake Karaoke. And this is their self-striping sock yarn and it's the same base as stroll um fingering which is so exciting i am thrilled to be able to use a felici so i will be using these two colors together um in a design idea that i have and i'm so excited about it i think it'll be these two i have to kind of figure it out now i think but it's going to be a really exciting project Alrighty, next we have size 11 16 inch circular needles these are the nickel plated ones which are my absolute favorite so this will be so great for hats and things like that and then we have the nickel plated interchangeable needle set these are the long tips again these are my absolute favorite needles so i'm super excited to be able to use the full set I have the size 7s right now, and they are just my favorite needles. So, I'm so excited to be able to use the full set. So, if you aren't familiar with Knit Picks Options needles, they are um, an interchangeable, they are interchangeable needle line that it, they all work together. Um, so, if you have one set, it will be adaptable for the another set as well if you were to buy another one in the future. Um, and they are just 
they're so great you can interchange the tips with the cords and then if you need the tips for um, another project you can attach these end caps that you can see right along here um, you can attach those to the cords and use your tips for another project and then join it back so simple I love interchangeable needles for that reason um, you can just have one set or a few sets or a bunch of sets um, but they all work with one another, so you don't have to have a bunch of thick circulars or anything like that. So, I really love these needles. Again, there is plastic over it, so that's why it is a little bit glary. Okay, next we have a bag. I'm actually going to open this up real quick so that you can see it better. This is a canvas zipper pouch bag. It says, Wool Enemy Number 1. <laughs> And it's a moth. That's quite hilarious. It has a sturdy zipper, which I love. And then it is lined on the inside. So this is going to be such a perfect bag for um, a sock project or a hat project, a, a small um, project like that, or notions or things like that. I'm really excited to use this. Again, it's canvas, so it's so sturdy, and I love that. Okay, next we have another bag. Oh my goodness. This is so cute. So this is another canvas bag, just like the um, one with the moth on it. Except this one says, knit one per two. And it has a picture of a cat and a yarn ball. Look at how pretty that is. It's um, painted. That's gorgeous. Again, it's the same canvas material. I love that it has this um, clip on the outside too, or this queuing, so you can attach it to another bag or attach something like your keys to it. Um, it makes it really portable. I really love it when, or strap actually, would be really nice as well. Again, it is also lined, and it's the same size as this one, I believe. Yes, so this is another item that will be available on the Knit Picks website very, very soon. Um, and I'm super excited for y'all to be able to get your hands on these bags. They are already so nice, and I can't wait to use them. Okay, and then last but not least, we have the Stroll Tonal Mini Pack. This is in total 100 grams or 462 yards, but it includes 5 20 gram hanks of Poppy Field, which is the mustard. Oat felt is the red. Let's see. Wine tasting is this beautiful kind of maroon red um, variegated yarn. Cordial is the deep maroon or deep burgundy. And then Pansy is this variegated autumnal purple. So this will also become a design along with this stroll glimmer i believe so keep an eye out for that um i'm really excited to get started on that design and get it out to you guys so i hope that you enjoy have enjoyed watching this nitpicks unboxing again i am so grateful for this opportunity and i cannot wait to talk with you all, all more about it and bring you along with this journey with me so i hope that you have enjoyed watching this video let me know in the comments below what your favorite product was and if you are excited for the new ones that will be arriving very soon. I will talk to you all next time. Bye!